don't even know what day it is. Sunday. It's Sunday. Um, it's our day. A super, our day three. Typically a, day two. <laughs> and we had a super late night last night. Like we didn't get to bed until I don't know four or five a.m. So we got a very late start, or I got a very late start today. Bill was up and early um, and out playing. So. It's like four o'clock. Four thirty right in the afternoon. This may be a record <laughs> for, for getting started. For getting late. Oh my gosh. Anyway, um, so we are just gonna kind of mess around these casinos for a little bit. No big plans for today. Um, and I guess we will take you along. If anything good happens, yeah. we'll let you know. Yeah. Nothing like having your first mimosa at almost five o'clock in the afternoon. So cheers. to grab our drinks. Dollar thirty six. Dollar thirty six. It's one of those games that has a lot, a lot of sound. On. <laughs> Three games do it. Oh my gosh, shut up. Very cool. Is that as loud as the game will go? I think you tried it. Oh, that's good. Here we go. Thank you. Here we go. All right, let's do it. Those are the progressives, by the way. So far, we've got a dollar sixty-eight. Oh my gosh! Look at that cute little puppy. Three games. Oh my gosh! Do it. Do it. Retrigger. Oh, dead spin. Do you not get to keep those coins? I have no idea. Or maybe you have to get so many of them. <laughs> maybe you have to get so many of them. Maybe it's like a Holden spin. We have really got to start reading the rules of these games. Oh, re-trigger. Another eight games. We only won five dollars, but we're getting lots of free games. Oh man, dead spin. Are you kidding? Are there any wild symbols? I have no idea. We got 12 more spins left. Get a 
re-trigger. That was our bonus 2580. We were just told that we cannot record in MGM anymore, um, which is weird. You can record your winnings, but you can't just record your games. So, yeah, weird. We're going to go find out some more info about that. But for now, um, no recording. So, that was our win 2580. Looks like the Rock and Roll Marathon is still happening. Las Vegas Boulevard is closed completely. For some reason, we thought it was happening during the day, but it's 6.18 in the evening, and look at all of these people participating in the race. I guess it's not a really a race at this point, but good for them. Here's Las Vegas Boulevard looking towards Mandalay Bay, and there are still so many people. I know you can't see them beyond the pedestrian bridge right there, but there's a ton of people still coming. Y'all, that view still doesn't get old. Definitely a lot busier than it was last night at 4 a.m. Here we are back at Whataburger the next day. Look at all those runners in there. <laughs> Keep marathon people at Whataburger. Ferries is open. They have like a hundred and something taps. 120 taps. 120 taps or something. Oh my god, it smells like weed out here. But yeah, nice to kind of see. Oh, they have a frozen espresso martini. Do they? Yes. You want one? Uh, no. I'm good. Next time. Las Vegas Boulevard is still closed. I think they are kind of finish up from the fun run or the work of the rock and roll marathon today anyway looks like they're <laughs> looks like they're breaking up the barricades now so it should be open soon <laughs> no I'm not we are both so ridiculously out of breath I don't even know why Oh, but, you know, classic Las Vegas escalators are not working right by the Waldo Orbit of Crystal Shops. But there are so many runners that are finished up here that look almost out of, as much out of breath as we are, right, Bob? Yeah, we're probably more out of breath than they are. <laughs> anyway. Oh my gosh, as much as we love Vegas, we would love to get back home and get back on track with our eating and drinking, but oh my gosh, look at this view, y'all. How does this ever get old? It is so crazy, as much as we love 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 this town and Bill and I were talking about how we hardly ever walk outside anymore because we're you know we're pretty loyal MGM um, yeah so we typically play at all the MGM hotels and basically between Mandalay and Bellagio you only have to walk outside maybe for a few minutes between New York New York um, the next caliber and the New York, New York and Park MGM. So, but anyway, it is such a beautiful night. It's got to be in like the mid 60s right now. But definitely beautiful. Look at this. All right, we are heading over to the Bellagio, so we will check in once we get there. <laughs> Look at this little beautiful Doberman mix in the Prada shop. Oh my goodness. We popped into 
Arte Museum. I think Bill's trying to find an escalator. So, FYI, um, once you pass Crystal Shops, if you don't want to go all the way down to Cosmo, you can cut into the gift shop of Arte Museum, and there are escalators that will take you up to the second level, where you can just kind of walk across to Cosmo instead of kind of going around and then, um, I don't even know where. But anyway, here we are. So now you can walk. This will take you right outside to Cosmo. So we are right at the exit of Cosmo, right next to Bellagio, and we're guessing this is the end of the race or the Rock and Roll Marathon, but look at all of these people now. It is a cluster F right now. Anyway, we are making our way over to Bellagio, so we'll see how long it's going to take us to get there. Y'all, look at all of these people. It is like walking upstream. It's so crazy. Although now that I'm looking at this, like I think we might want to go down. There's some DJs, some tents. You have no idea what's happening, but it looks fun. right now on um, the walkway kind of up to Bellagio from the street and look at this craziness down on the street. I know you probably can't hear it. It's like right in front of Paris in Horseshoe in the Bellagio on the street but it is craziness down there. We might have to go check it out. to Bellagio and the line to check in was so long and it looked like a bunch of conference attendees and <laughs> they did not look happy to be here. <laughs> I'm sure it took them so long to get here from the airport because of the street closures. But anyway, we're going to try um, our luck at some try to look at the Bellagio games and we'll see how it goes. Sorry, not sure what happened there. Halfway through our, almost halfway through our budget. We're well, not our budget, but our money in this machine. Three dollars on fireballs. I think maybe the other bank of ultimate firelink. You know the ones further down. Okay, eleven dollar line hit. Oh, and the mini. One hundred seventy-two. Oh mini. my goodness! Yeah, those are the progressives. By the way, look at that minor. Look at that major. I mean, we know the mega. Any of them right there. I know we know the mega is a little out of reach, but we'll keep trying. Oh. One more, do it, do it, do it. Yes. Yes, please.
That's game. Okay, we got one free game. That was four. Game number five out of seven. Another free game. Excellent. Is that $60? Yeah. Oh, nice. Come on, we need some free games. We need some free games. We need some free games. All right, last spin. Oh, come on, Fireball. All right, seventy-four fifty. The bonus is to get you just below. I know. <laughs> it like gets you so close. Ninety-seven dollars. Told you. All right, we'll do a couple of backups. Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. I feel a fireball bonus coming. Although I think we're like, I think the ones at the back of Bellagio were, seem to be a little better. I'm fine stopping at 80. I'm fine stopping at 80. Oh. That's so mean. Should we stop? At 60? <laughs> Bill! He's so weak. Okay, we're going to 60. 60 or 100, whatever comes first. Okay, 60 or 100. Let's hope for 100. <laughs> this thing owes us a fireball bonus. Oh, look 40. at that ball. Look at all those dynamites, too. How many times have we gotten three fireballs? Again. Uh-oh. Our last spin. Oh, it was 850 line hit. Nice. Okay, 550. Can I get in here? Ooh, look at all those tens. Nothing lines up. Uh-oh. It's 59 or I stop right now. What should I do? This could be your fireball <laughs> Damn it, Bill. He is so weak. Okay, 59 bucks. Stop. Sure. Okay, I think we're going to stop and move to the ultimate fire link um, towards oh, the back after we get our drinks. All right. You now we just played um, $100 in blackjack and actually walked away with 280 So we we're pretty happy with that. We played for a really long time. So now we are going to um, put some money in this mystery of the lamp machine. So Bill put, what'd you put in? $20 on your 151, so we were up at 171. Yeah, and then, so we moved over from the machine we were at a minute ago, and then he's only betting 80 cents, and then he got the boost active. So we'll see what happens. Bonus. Is it is the volume turned up all the way? Pop that one. Yeah, let's do it. No. Let's do it, do it, do it. There we go. Nice. Oh, do the jackpot. Do it, do it, do it. Uh oh. Nice. Jackpot. 
Not yet. Another boost. Nice. Collect. No. No. Nope. Not yet. Again. Okay. Oh, that scared me. What do you want to give us? She pops up like she's so excited. It's $20 on Twenty, twenty, twenty. Oh. That is bullshit. Give us 20 on each one. <laughs> okay, another three more spins. Six, five spots left. Uh-oh. Come on. Let, oh, no. Oh, last, spin. last spin. Drop it. Drop one in. Oh, bummer. The treasure is yours. Is it? The uh, treasure is ours. Ten dollars. Ten dollars. Well, 80 cent bet. You know, what are you going to do? Well, then. 160 will play to 160. Okay. Or 170. <laughs> 200. 160 or 200. <laughs> yeah. I think Jackpot's got a pop here. I'm on I jackpot. think we're gonna get to 160 we have first. Less spins left. Less spin. Oh no. Oh well. All right. Okay. Cool. At least we got to see that other bonus. All right. Let's move along. We need to go find some food. I turn my 20 into 10. Yay! to stop at the Henry on the way back because we were so hungry and I didn't even realize they were open this late but looks like I know I did not realize they're open 24 hours um, but we did ask one of the kind of I guess security guards at the front door and he was like yeah the Henry's open and he said secret piece is open till 4 a.m. But we were not feeling pizza again, so here we are. So we're excited. All right, Bill. All right. We also decided to have an 8.05 at midnight. Didn't that look good? <laughs> Savoring it. Savoring it. He's at crazy. 12.11. At 12.11. Oh my gosh, Bill. It's going to be another late day tomorrow, isn't it? We're flying out tomorrow, so it can't be too late. <laughs> we got some things we need to get done. Right? We'll figure it out. I built up the chicken tenders with buffalo on the side and blue cheese. And then I got the Henry breakfast with eggs over easy, bacon, sourdough toast, and hash browns. Look at those hash browns. They look delicious. And then of course our little minis look how cute. That's ketchup, jam, and butter. <laughs> so we are gonna eat this up. All right, y'all, we just finished up at the Henry, and what'd you think? Good. I it was I mean, good too. At midnight, a little bit of breakfast chicken tenders. <laughs> yeah, I think it was good. I mean, prices were reasonable. I mean, just the fact that it was an option for late night dining was great. But it was good so, food. Yeah, it was good, good food. Good, good, good service, food for, too. Good food for midnight. Yeah, and good service. So we definitely go back there again. 
Um, so we're still at the Cosmo, so now we're going to try our luck at some machines, use them for a free play, right? Yep, use right. it up. Let's do it. All right, so Bill found this regular top dollar here at the Cosmo, and he put 20 in. Apparently, we have free play, but you can use it on this machine. So he's just going to use up his $20 here, and we will move on. Thousand. Second offer. So seventy. Thirty-five dollars. Oh, that's it. Oh, you're yeah. doing fifty cents. Oh. oh, honey, I don't know. Yeah, that's a winner. You do. What's it say? Best, Best place, place says fake offer. offer. Okay. Yeah, seventy is pretty good. So I just ordered a club soda with the lime at the Cosmo. And look how cute these little Pellegrino bottles are. Love it. Bill got tequila on the rocks. I think Casamigos, right? Casamigos Reposado. All right. We are over at Dragon Link. We got a bonus. Doing dollar spins. Get a word. Let's get a minor. Three spins again. Four spots left. Spin. Okay. We're not sure if we closed out um, the vlog last night. Did we? I don't know if we did. Anyway, um, after we left the Henry, we gambled for a little bit at the Cosmopolitan and then ended up just walking back and going to bed because we knew today we would have to be up a little bit earlier just to get our stuff packed because we are checking out. We got a late checkout for one, um, but it's about 11 or 1045 right now, so we're going to run down um, just to the Avenue Cafe and grab a bite to eat and then come back and grab our bags and I think we have to head to the airport probably about five o'clock um, but yeah so our plan today I think is to head to Park MGM and Aria which we haven't been to yet since we've been here which is crazy um, so I think that's the plan for today so we'll check in a little later so we had a buy one, get one drink at the lobby bar at MGM, so we just stopped in. 
um, grab a couple of mimosas and then we are gonna head out to grab some food. I ended up with the club sandwich with fries and Bill got the build your own burger, added jalapenos to it. So it's probably 12 o'clock and the line to hold your luggage is so long. So in case you guys didn't know, um, gold members and up have a priority line and we just walked right up and there was nobody there. They took our bags within like a minute and we were done. I don't know if you could see that line over there. So if you're gold member and up, definitely look for that gold priority line. Well, it is an absolutely beautiful day on the strip. I think the high today is 71 and it is so perfect out here right now. Oh, that breeze is so incredible. I don't remember ever seeing this before. Luke's lobster, lobster rolls, yum. Have to come back and try that sometime. Park MGM. So we had a My Vegas reward for one free cocktail at the lobby bar at um, Aria. And we both chose to get these beautiful watermelon margaritas and they are so good. Um, so again, that's a My Vegas reward for a free cocktail. Now we are leaving the Aria. We basically lost all of our money here. Um, we're a little bummed about that, but that's okay. We had a good time. So we are going to leave the Aria. I think it's about maybe 2.30. We're going to head over to Park MGM and then um, make our way back over to MGM to get our Uber to the airport. A little sad to be leaving, but again, a little happy to get home. So anyway, we'll see when we get to Park. Way over to Park MGM. Even if you didn't see the sign, you could definitely tell we were there by the carpet. <laughs> anyway, we'll go try to find a machine to play on. Look at the pool area at Park MGM. A few more weeks and that bar is going to be open, serving up Dole Whips. We cannot wait. Alright y'all. We are heading out. So sad. It's the most beautiful day here today. So we're heading over to MGM Grand. Saying goodbye. Till next time, which is in like three and a half weeks. We'll be back. Anyway. Alright. We are making our way out of MGM. Look how pretty that lion is. Beautiful. So we 
are <laughs> sitting at the airport. Um, stopped by the PGA Grill and got a couple of to-go beers. There's mine. Bill's pretty empty. Anyway, thought we'd play a couple of these Wheel of Fortune games. Um, so yeah, max bet on this one is a buck twenty-five. We will see how it goes. Yeah, pretty sure I wasn't recording any of what I was doing just now. Alright, Bill got the wheel bonus playing next to me. 100! 40. Did you get a multiplier? Oh, you only get $10? Oh, that's right, it's quarters. Back to back. Right, going back to mine. Why do none of those line up? Is that my last one? Oh, I think I'm done. I have no more money. Well, that was not how I wanted to end this trip. I may move along and find another winning machine. Bill still has forty-one dollars. Forty-one dollars. Ordered our flight. I think we're both a little bummed to be leaving, but also a little happy to be getting home. You can see the bag under my eyes. We are so tired. Anyway, here we go. Hopefully we can get a decent deal. Outside. Airport. Anyway, we will be back here in a couple of weeks or three weeks or so. So we're not completely sad, but I'm so happy to get home to our dogs. Anyway, um, thanks for following along with us, and we will see you in a few weeks.